Okay, so I have my Samsung Galaxy S3 here, and I'm gonna show you how to wipe the cache partition. Now, first take note, when you wipe the cache partition, you are not gonna delete any of your personal files or anything. Basically, it's going to free up a lot of your uh, temporary internet files. It's gonna clear that out. And the chances are that it can help speed up your phone as well as uh, um, get rid of the lag and even increase your battery life. So I, every time you update the phone, you really should do a wipe cache. Now, wiping the cache partition, you are not wiping the entire phone. You're not doing a, uh, a factory reset. We're just wiping the uh, temporary files. So anyways, again, S3. So what you want to do is you want to first you want to go ahead and um, power down the phone. So let's power down. And like I said, especially like during like after an update, I mean, some people do it periodically. Well, they'll do it every like couple weeks or every month or so. Just to wipe your cache partition. I've done it like once where I had um, I actually had really lagging issues, especially on my camera app. And I've tried everything to fix it, but once I wiped the cache partition, surprisingly, it would open up like fast again. So, <clears throat> so my phone is off now. So we want to do is you want to hold three buttons down simultaneously. You want to hold the power up button the home button and the power button simultaneously okay so I'm gonna put my fingers on it and then I'm gonna go one two three hold it and then once you hear once you feel a vibrate you can go let go of the power let go of the power here I'm still holding it down and then once your recovery systems options uh, menu comes on recovery options menu you can go ahead and let it go and that's fine you can let it go here now from here we have several things now the thing take note first be careful you do not want to wipe you, you don't want to wipe the data slash factory reset, okay? You do that, you're going to lose everything on your phone. What you want to do is use the volume down rocker here. Just go down, 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 and just go to wipe cache partition, okay? Do not do, again, do not do the factory reset. And we're at wipe cache partition, and now what you do is you want to go ahead and click on the power button to select it. So I'm going to push it. And now you can see that it's... Uh, wiping cache and it says uh, wipe cache complete and very top here it says reboot system now it's on the, the default there so I'm just going to simply tap on my power button and let the system reboot and that's pretty much it if you guys have questions or anything just comment below thanks bye